Welcome at Smile. It is comfy, cozy edition. I am snug as a bug in a rug, but really I'm in my bed thanking the divine creator for another day that has passed. I'm keeping warm and um, covering my crown chakra because I've been receiving the most amazing channelings because I am growing in the universe as I've stated to you guys. When I started this channel, I had recently transcended from the dark night of the soul. Um, for those of you that know about spirituality, it is a real thing. Um, my choice to live in my aviation divination began in 2016. I moved away from New York in 2017 in order not only to accept, but to further explore the divination that I was receiving and had no idea that it was my ideation. Um, I was born this way and I'm thankful for it. Now that I have accepted it, Miss Adiation Divination, and I understand what it is that I've had from birth, I manifest in it and I live in it and I'm... I'm glad to do so. Now, I told you I'm comfy cozy, so I'm wearing my man's underwear and, you know, I don't have no boxes. Huh. These are his. Um, I don't have underwear. Because I don't wear none of that shit. I don't care. That's not what it's about. But I thank you for tuning in and tuning up with me. The channeling I received, we are at the end of the year, as we call it. Um, may you guys share your Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa with those that matter to you. May you be blessed. May you feel abundant joy in your soul. May you radiate the love to those that you surround yourselves with. I declare these things from the purest love that I know how to give you. May you embrace it. May you manifest in it and may you enjoy it. I hope that you enjoy nutritious meals, heart healthy meals with those that you love. And um, remember, no drinking and driving so you don't be like me. And um, I hope that you spend this last couple of days before the year ends in harmony and receiving your channeling, your aviation, what is great for your alignment so that you can evolve into the next facet of your life. Uh, I've said this before and I'll say it again. 2020, numerology is real. I'm just sharing with you the knowing that I know because of my sight beyond the naked eye. So 2020, portal year. Year of manifestation, clear vision. To tune in, to align into the, the clarity of vision of your creator, your divination to receive the clarity and the discernment and to be in clear vision of your mission soul's purpose a lot of people miss the portal year because of lack of awareness lack of belief just lack in self i hope you catch up i don't know how you're gonna do that but i know that as long as you have faith and drive mercy and grace is upon the being not granted by I, but the divine creator. Right. So 2021, 2021 was a year of manifestation of the clear vision, meaning whatever you discerned and received in clarity was a necessity or a downfall to your greater being and the greater good of your existence and those you coincide with was supposed to be either developed or eradicated. And for those that have the discipline, as I, it hasn't been easy, but I'm doing it every single day. Now, I know for a fact 2022 is going to be a year of accepting divine union, your divine union with A, your divine creator, two, or 
your divine counterpart, your divine feminine or your divine masculine. So if you are in a relationship, a loving relationship, committed relationship, polygamous relationship, sexual relationship, and you want it to thrive or understand that you're not being fulfilled emotionally, mentally, spiritually, sexually, financially in those relationships, uh, 2022 is going to be a year of... Uh, Make it or break it. Um, I am living my adhesion divination. And so I don't take slack from my counterpart. Because being with me is a privilege. To have this kind of love is a privilege. And so because I see the value in those that I love. I treat you with just as much respect, understanding, compassion, that part. So my man, that is my man right now. That part. Love me or leave me, but don't half-ass me. 2022 will be a year of divine union. Divinity is going to thrive. And I don't just mean in relationships. I mean us. As a communal, collaborative community. As the humane and humane, uh, what's that? Humankind that we are. Even though everyone is not human <laughs> or humane. Um, this is our year to manifest in our union. Unity as brothers and sisters. Unity as co-workers. Where we do not have unity, we can be divided and conquered. And you're only as weak or as strong as you allow your circumference, your environment, what you surround yourself and encompass yourself in and with. And I encompass circumference and live in my one, with my one, for my one. Guys, I love you. And um, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year's. All the holidays that I don't celebrate. May you enjoy your time together. Tomorrow is the 24th. Christmas Eve. Kwanzaa. However you may celebrate. Continue to celebrate life. The gift that you are. May you receive this adiation divination that I share with you. May you start to understand that the truth has been tainted and that what is real and sounds unbelievable is totally what is. 2022, right around the corner. Are you ready? I love you for free because I can.